All right. Hello, ladies. Hey, Tammy. How are are you ladies? What's going on, everybody? Let's see here. Give me a second to get this muted. This is going to pop on. There we go. Okay. How's everybody doing? Are we ready for some good sales tonight? How's everybody been? What's everyone up to? I feel like I haven't seen you guys in forever. Last week's sale was just horrible when I went on Wednesday because of YouTube. It was just absolutely terrible. Um, because the chat was disappearing and I just, I had to end it. So I apologize to that for everyone. <sighs> um, hey, Elaine, how are you? Hey, Pearl, how are you doing? So this week's been good though. We had a visit at my sister's house today with the kids and my parents. So we had a great day. How about you guys? What are you guys all up to? And we're doing the farm series, so I've been working on that on the side here and there. So, what's everybody up to? What's everyone working on? Hey, Angie, how you doing? Good to see you. <clears throat> I hope everyone's well. Doing great, taking draperies apart. Nice drapery, like for material. Huh? I've got a nice hot cup of coffee. It's fabulous. Yes, I have fabric tonight. We have books. We have all sorts of goodies. You've been working on Christmas cards? Oh, awesome, Angie. I was doing some of that myself not too long ago. And Elaine is sorting lace and ribbons. Awesome. Uh, I have to test them. Oh, very nice, Pearl. Very nice. Awesome. Okay, so StreamYard seems to be faster than my YouTube tonight, which is really unusual. Huh. We'll have to see how that goes. We'll give everybody a few minutes to hop on in here, and then we'll get started. What's everybody have planned for the weekend? Anything good? Anything good at all? I'm just going to do some crafting, anybody? You're going to be going out? I think I will be doing some crafting and still working on the farm series uh, materials and um, prepping that for Monday. And uh, actually, Monday is a holiday. I may have to do... Hmm, I may have to do that farm series on Tuesday. We'll see. But yeah, I'll be I'll be working on that kind of stuff and um I will be probably doing some stuff with the family. We have some plans to go out. Nothing but watching football. Nice, Angie. Susie. Hey Susie. I got your package today. The ring is so pretty. Oh, you're so welcome. I'm so happy that you want it, Susie. I'm so happy that you want it. Enjoy, my friend. Getting things up to the attic, having a sale. Who's on Sunday? Awesome. What time is your sale on Sunday, Pearl? How fun. So make sure everybody goes over. It's, is it going to be on your channel, Pearl, or loses? What about everybody else? What is everyone else doing? Talk to me, ladies. Talk to me. So this will be... Oh, yes, Susie. Thank you so much. The Defy auction is Saturday at noon. Yes. Thank you for bringing that up. 
everybody try to hop on over there and it's going to be a little bit different this month which i'm pretty excited about it's there's no shipping involved in this particular auction for defy um i believe it's a lot of classes and um that kind of thing um so it's going to be really different and really fun so everybody try to hop over to cares on saturday hey natalie how are you good to see you thanks for coming uh, Pearl says to Eastern. Okay, on mine, we are hoping that her friend Mary will feel up to selling for a little while. Oh, okay. Um, so it could be three of you selling. Will Mary be selling with Luz on, at her, on her channel? Or with Luz on your channel, right? Is that how you're going to do it? Natalie, how are you doing, dear? It's good to see you. So if you guys weren't here last week on Wednesday when I tried to do the sale, which like, again was just terrible because of YouTube, um, we were going to do this doily giveaway. So we're going to do that tonight. Okay. So it's a beautiful set of doilies, two different sizes. So pretty, pretty, pretty. Look at that edging. And they're a nice weight too. So we're going to be doing that as giveaway tonight. Oh, good, Natalie. Oh, you'll be on your channel losing that long she's modding. Got it. Okay, cool. Well, that sounds like fun. I will definitely try to make it in there. All right, thank you, Angie. Yes, Susie says she's offering a beginning ASL class for the auction, which is so wonderful. And I have seen Susie guys do um, the signing for care before on one of her lives and Susie's fabulous. So um, if you'd like to learn how to sign, make sure you sign up for Susie's class. That's going to be amazing. Thank you so much for offering that Susie. That is like phenomenal. It's um, for sign language, Natalie. Hey, Tina, how are you? Good to see you. Yeah, so um, actually at one of Kara's lives, Susie was on and she was signing um, everything that Kara was saying. It was wonderful. So if you guys have a chance to get on there and um, sign up for that class, that'll be awesome. Such a wonderful service she's offering. Mm. Oh, you can't send one to me, Tina? Okay, hold on. Yeah, I haven't heard Tina from you. Hold on, let me send you one right now then. So it's, well, you know what, let me just do this. Yes, Susie, and I, uh, Tina, I do have your order too. Oh, it's not gonna let me, let me go this way. Oh, sorry, I didn't wanna do that. How do I do, okay, sorry, I was trying to, Highlight it. Hold on. Hold on. Yep, Tina, no problem. I have your order sitting here, so no worries. I'm going to send you an email right now. And I will just put hello. Um, that is coming your way right now. Tina, let me know when you get it. Um, let me know as soon as you get it. So I know you have it. Um, but all I need from you, Tina, and I think that's what the problem was, is when you sent me the email, you didn't send me your, your information. So I need your YouTube name, your real name and your shipping information, the, the actual shipping address. That way I can figure out your shipping and do your invoice for you. Okay. So let's see what else is going on here. Let me catch back on chat. Uh, and welcome, Tina. It's good to see you. American Sign Language. Yeah. Uh, Pearl's waiting for an invoice from you. Oh, Pearl's. She's probably working on that, I'm sure. Uh, you're welcome, Tina. Thank you for coming in and asking. Oh, Susie, you're so welcome. <clears throat> I think it's a wonderful service that you're offering. Hey, Mitz. Hey, Mindy. How are you? You got it. Okay, Tina. Yeah, so just send me that information and I'll get your invoice out to you. How are you, Mindy? 
What's going on with you, girly? All right. So if everyone doesn't mind giving me a big old thumbs up and also just share this, you know, send a message out to your friends, let people know that we're on, that sort of thing. Um, and that always helps, helps, you know, people to remember because sometimes people forget or they don't get the notifications. So I urge you to, uh, to all lend a helping hand. Thank you so much. All right. Let's see here. We're going to get started in just a minute. Almost caught up now. We got yours out early. Morning. There we go. Yeah, Pearl's super busy, I'm sure. Oh, I'm so glad you're happy to be here, Mindy. You're so sweet. All right. So we can start off with the readers in a moment, if you'd like. I'm just trying to give it a few more minutes. And um, how's, how's, how's everyone else doing? Everyone's doing good? Everybody's doing good, I hope. I'm excited for Cure's Auction. That's going to be fun. I'm excited for Pearls. All these fun stuff. So you guys want to start with the readers? They're going to be $4, just like we were doing last Wednesday. And yes, I was on last Wednesday.
Okay, we are back <clears throat> on the same stream. Are you guys still here? I thought I was going to have to start a new stream. Let's see here. I'm back. Everybody still here? Thank you, thank you. Oh my gosh, I'm telling you, this has been just terrible internet stuff lately. Hopefully everybody finds their way back. <clears throat> okay, hi Natalie. Hey Tammy. Hey Tammy Case, how are you? Good, <laughs> good vibes. <laughs> Yeah, we'll just give them a few to pop in. Hi, Pearl. Yeah, sorry, guys. I thought I was going to have to start a whole new stream, but it let me right back in here. So we'll give everyone a few minutes to pop back in, and then we'll just get to town with the readers. Oh, my gosh. I'm telling you. Oh, yes, Tammy. Me, too. Do you have any plans? Are you doing some crafting or going out anywhere, doing anything fun? We got Tammy C and Tammy M. Hey, Kateri. Hey, Lisa. Hey, Susie. Is Candy here too? Hey, Candy. Thank you guys so much for popping back in. I appreciate it. Hopefully, we'll get everybody back. And not have any more issues. That would be fabulous. And we'll get started. I think everybody just needs a minute to realize that we're back on here. So again, we're going to do the giveaway at some point tonight, you guys, for the doilies. For anyone that's new, it just popped in. Oh, good, Tina. So it's for the matching set of doilies. We're going to give those away tonight. All right. Let's see here. Okay. All right. Hey, Lisa H. Hopefully everybody can find us. Yeah, guys, if you don't mind, just sending a message out to your friends. Let them know that we're on, that we're here. It would be great. Greatly appreciated. I said we're going to restart a stream, so they're all probably looking for the stream. <laughs> oh, no. Oh my gosh, I'm telling you. So I want to give it a minute. I don't want to start and let people lose out. Susie's here. Thank you, Susie. Roll call. Roll call. So yeah, we'll finish the rest of the Reader's Digest. We have three... Six, nine, I have 10 left of these. And then we have some fabric and linens, um, some tickets and some trim, I think, that we're gonna do. Some books too, lots of goodies. Lots and lots, but I figured we'd just finish up with these since that's what we left off with on Wednesday. I love these covers, you guys. Do you guys love the readers, too? They're so pretty. They're so pretty. Oh, and then Facebook, too? Oh, my gosh. 
I'm telling you. I am telling you, if we lose out tonight again, if it if it does one of the big, horrible black circles again tonight, I'm just going to lose it. I'm telling you. <laughs> just going to lose it. You do, Tammy. Yeah, they're so pretty. They're all so pretty and so unique. So we'll start with these in just a moment. All right, you ready? Okay, so let me show you. Hey, Angie, thank you. Love the readers. Here's A. So this has like the brown and then like kind of a tannish brown flower and then the green going through it. It's really very pretty. Actually, I'm showing it upside down, I'm sorry. Let's try that again. Isn't it pretty? And there's the spine. And it's gilded at the top. So that's A. B has a nice like hunter green spine. And then like a moss and another lighter shade of green. Let's see if that will focus. So that one's very pretty too. This one's gilded at the top too. And then this one has the hunter green, another shade of green here, and then like almost like a burgundy running through it. Very pretty. This is fine, and that one's gilded as well. So these are all $4, so it's A, B, or C. <clears throat> it's a conspiracy, it might be. E, Tammy, it might be. Okay, are you ready? So I'm going to put them in. They're $4 each. Um, and you guys just let me know which ones you want. And I'll try to do one per person at first if I, if there's, um, if there's a lot of people, okay? Just to try to make it fair. Okay, so... Lisa is taking A. Thank you, Lisa. Just so you guys know, some of the spines are a lot older on these. So some of them are, you know, they want to come away from themselves, but they're still, they're still in decent shape. Okay, and then Lisa wants C as well. Got it. Anybody for B before I move on? Thank you, Lisa. <clears throat> okay, so there's B. Okay, the next one, this is going to be A. This is a brown cover with a floral running through it, almost like a ribbon and a floral. It's really pretty. There we go. Really, really pretty. It's got like a dark chocolate spine, the yellow. Gilded at the top, it's A. B is the green, and then it has the gold and black polka dots, which is really pretty. And then that orange-ish spine. Um, and that one's gilded. Okay, C is already, this, like a, this is a perfect example of the spine coming apart. It's already half, this piece has already come off of it. Just so you know that some of them are like that, okay? But that one is a part. But this one is really fun. This one is striped. It's got like a pencil. No, it's just dust. Um, like a light blue with a light green and gray stripe running through it. And like more of a burgundy um, spine. And that one's gilded as well. So that's the next set. The ruffle, yeah. <laughs> Okay, so here we go. That one's going in. Okay, so Lisa for A. Lisa. Mm 
Am I really still here? Like just froze on me. It's still frozen. Oh my gosh, you guys. I hope it's still there. You guys, can you hear me? Just focusing, all right? Here, okay. Whew. All right, so those two are still available. Any takers on those before I move them? Just focus. You're here, good, perfect, okay. So these two are left. I'm gonna move those. Okay, and then the next ones, um, A is going to be the tone-on-tone -tone greens, really pretty greens, and this is like a hunter green. That is foil, um, gilded. This one has got these florals, really very pretty, and like a, almost like a black, no, more navy, I think. I think it's navy on the spine. It's very pretty. That's B. C is like um, a blue and red. It's really pretty floral. And then a hunter green. And that one's gilded as well. Hey, Amanda. <coughs> I'm happy to see you. No, no worries. We are doing the readers. I'm going to pop these in there. $4. No worries. I'm glad you're here. How are you? Okay, so that is the next set. Anybody for A, B, or C? Okay. Yep. Absolutely, Lisa, you can have them. You want them all. Okay. No problem. No one else has said anything. So you've got them, Lisa. You are the lucky lady tonight. Wonderful. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, and then I have one more that you haven't seen yet. Now, what does Amanda say? I think I cannot complain. Mm -hmm. This one will just be um, on its own, but this one has like the tone on tone browns. It's really pretty. It actually kind of looks mermaid ish if you look at it that way, right? The scales. And then it has the cream. Um, spine and then the gold gilding. So I'm just going to put that by itself. That's going in. What'd you do at Laura's? <clears throat> what did you do, Angie? What did you do? Okay, nobody for that one? All right, I will go back through the last four that didn't sell at the end um, for anyone that didn't get to see them because we just have four that didn't sell. The rest are all sold. So let me move these. Let's sec. All right. Well, actually, we can do these tickets first. All right. Um, so these tickets are the double-sided, well, not double-sided, but they're the two-pack um, 
This particular one is lighter because it came at the end. Let me find a different one to show you. But these are old tickets. They are definitely not new. Um, I wish there was some kind of a date on there, but there is not. They do say printed in the USA. Um, so these came at the very end of the roll. So they're lighter at the bottom. And then these are what most of them look like. So you have a strip of, they're red too. I don't know if they're coming across as red. No, it's just allergies, Amanda. Yeah, just allergies, unfortunately. Um, but you get in the pack, you get 12, a strip of 12. Um, but really, so I counted them 12 this way, one, two, three. But really, you get 24 because you have two on each row, right? So you get like 24. And that's a dollar for those. And I have plenty, you guys. If you want more than one pack, you're more than welcome because there's plenty. All right, you ready? So these are for the red tickets. Okay. I have these. I have them this way. Drink green tea that has honey in it. Oh, yeah. Oh, they really are a pain. Anybody for the red tickets before I move those out of our way? Oh, here we go. That's why I had it. Yeah, sometimes they just come on, but usually they don't stay for long. So, the next item I have is trim, and this is a vintage trim. It is like a fabric trim with the lace on the sides. So, let me see if I can show it to you well enough. So, it's a vintage trim, vintage fabric trim with the lace on the sides. It's really pretty. And you have a yard of that for a dollar. So, I'll put that in. If anyone's interested in that trim, it's really pretty. Let's see. Oh, come on. You we were just showing it a minute ago. There we go. Very pretty. So there's that one. All right. Hey, Erin. How are you? Oh, hey, Tina. I didn't see you come back either. Hey, Tina. Hey, Erin. And Pearl, you'd like one? Sure. Does anyone else want any? There's plenty of those. Thanks, Pearl. Okay. Oh, really? Yeah. You want three? Sure. Times three. You got it, Pearl. Thank you. All righty. So yours. I get migraines and allergies. Oh, yeah. I have terrible migraines, too. Let me know. Okay, so. Let's see. Amanda. Oh. 
it's going to take one and then Tina up is going to take two. Thank you, ladies. Me too, too. Got it, Tammy. <laughs> Tammy. Times two. Anybody else for the pretty ribbon? Or ribbon. Trim. Lace. <laughs> uh, that's hers. And two more. Thank you much, ladies. I have to mute for one second. Okay. All right, let's go to something else. Let's do the fabrics. Shall we do the fabrics? All right. So... These are just over a half yard, and this is a really pretty dark purple on black. It looks a lot lighter on YouTube. I don't think YouTube is doing it justice, but it's a really brilliant purple on the black. It's really, yeah, like the purple, it just like pops. It's very dull on this screen, unfortunately. But there are two of those, they're half yards. And I'm going to put those in for $3. Like I said, they're a little over a half yard. $3. And there's two. Becky's here. Hey, Becky. How you doing? So for, yes. So after tonight, Tina, I'll be invoicing. Correct. Yep. Oh, Becky, your sister has a drink too. Oh my goodness. Prayers to her. Hey, Christina. They're purple, Christina. Um, hello, new to your channel. Well, hello, Paula. Welcome. Welcome to the channel. Welcome. And Kay, Kay's Beautiful Struggle. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Okay. How did about 8 p.m.? It was her G2. <sighs> Oh my gosh, Becky, I'm so sorry to hear that. Oh, thanks, Erin. Oh, big prayers coming her way, Becky. Um, okay, so ladies that are new here, what I need you to do is to send me an email before the sale's over. Um, my email is in the description box, um, but I'm going to put it in chat for you. what I need is um, your YouTube name, your username, and your shipping address information so that I can ship, I can get your shipping rates for you. And I invoice through PayPal. I invoice every, after every second Friday's sale. So I invoice basically like twice a month. So this is our second week. So I'll be invoicing after tonight. Ah, and there we go. Aaron's awesome. Thank you, Aaron. Um, there is, for anyone new, there is a $1.50 service charge on your invoice um, just to help absorb PayPal and overhead costs, that sort of thing. Um, but welcome. Welcome, everyone that's new. Thank you all so much for coming. Hey, Sharon, how are you? Paula and Kay are part of our circle. Awesome. Thanks, Kay. Okay, so let's get back to who got these. All right, ladies. <clears throat> so let me just go back up. And after I refresh, let's see who got them. Um, okay, so Kay got one of them. Kay's Beautiful Struggle. I like that name. 
Very nice. Okay. And Paula. P S E N Paula. Congrats, ladies. Welcome, welcome to the channel. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, so I do live sales every Friday night. I also have a new series right now that I've started, a new farm series. So you're welcome to join along with that. That's a lot of fun as well. Okay. These are... Huh. Hold on one moment. Yeah, these are a half yard. Okay. I don't know what happened there. These are a half yard. Huh. And so this is old but new um new stock, but the new old stock, right? Is that how you say it? New old stock. So it's an older fabric, um, but brand new, never, you know, never been taken off the bolt until now. Oh, great, Kay. <laughs> so the purple one to check it out. So, yeah, so this is really pretty. It's different colored, um, not different color, but it's like the pinks, pinkies, and light pinks, and mauves, roses, and then the greenery and the blue background. Let me hold it up a little bit so you can see it. Isn't that pretty? And it has like a really pretty fun background so that is that and those are half yards yeah it's pretty didn't fold back right I don't know what happened okay so here we go so those will be three as well this is for the half yard. And there's several of these. Hey, Tina T, how are you? <clears throat> Good to see you. Gosh, sorry, guys. I should put that right there, shouldn't I? <laughs> Probably should. I hate pink, but I create journals for others. I love florals. Oh, and you know, if you hate pink, too, you know, you guys, I've done this before, and I've actually sold packs with these, not this particular fabric, but a, a, a very pretty pink fabric that had lots of pretty pink florals. I coffee dyed it, and it came out so old and um, vintage looking, and it did not have that same pink anymore. So if you were to coffee dye this, you could tone down that pink to a very vintage, almost like sepia look. Very cool. Very cool, guys. Okay, so there's my little spiel on that. That's what I've done in the past. <laughs> <clears throat> okay, so uh, Becky would like to. Thanks, Becky. Let's do that. And Kay would like one. Thanks, Kay. Yep, so if you're not into pink, don't worry about that. You can change it up and make it look totally different. Pearl. Thanks, Pearl. And you guys, if you do need to talk to me and I'm not seeing it, which very well may happen because um, when I do these on my own, sometimes the chat goes too fast or I just miss something, just type in all caps again. You're not annoying me or anything. Just go ahead and feel free to... Type it in caps, type it in caps. Okay, so that was pearl. Let's see, love vintage Victorian pink only. Ah, yes. <laughs> it's fake answer. Okay, and there's still one, two, there's still four left. So if anybody wants any more, there's still four available. Let me put that in here. Okay. There's that one. Alrighty. Next one. 
Oh, you guys. This one is my favorite. Favorite. Favorite, favorite. Are you ready? Wait, are you saying you want two more, Becky? Of the blue and pink? Did you want two more, Becky? Okay, thanks, Becky. Okay, so just two available now, ladies. Gotcha, Becky. Thank you. Ah, <laughs> gotcha. Perfect. All right. Wonderful, wonderful. Okay. All right. So this one is truly like my favorite, you guys. Okay. So this is more not canvas, but oh, I don't know what you want to call it. And I wish there was a label on here and there's not that says it anyways. It's by um, Amatex. Um but it, it has like a really soft canvas feeling. Does that make sense? Let me hold it up close so you can see what I'm talking about. Very soft, canvasy feeling. And see how it frays? Oh, it's beautiful. Okay, let me hold this one. Oh, Lord. I almost dropped that pile. Oh, my gosh. Okay. You guys. Oh my gosh, you guys, this one is so pretty. <sighs> Duck cloth, maybe? I'm not sure. I don't know the differences, unfortunately. I need like an expert to like literally hand me a piece of this, a piece of that, a piece of that, so I can feel it and tell. Um, but yeah, it is awesome fabric and it frays awesome. But look at the colors and the texture of it. Let me try to hold it up. Um, it's just, look at the background. You guys, it is so pretty. Where am I trying to hold it? I was trying to hold oh, here. And if you look here at the top, it's got like more of the blue and pink. It's just, and it has that tan in the background. Um, oh, it's so pretty. So these are half yards. Twill? Maybe it's twill. I'm not sure. It's so pretty. So these are half yards. And these are going to be $4.50 for the half yard. Um, I only have a few of these. But, oh, how did I have it folded? I don't remember. I don't remember. Nope, it wasn't that way. Must have been this way. Okay, so the other thing is, I'm gonna take your goes in just one second. I'll see I didn't fold it right. I have four of those, and then I have one that is a little over a yard, but there's a chunk missing out of it. So, hey, Donna. Um, so I'll put that one in after, okay? So right now, we're doing the half yards, and these are 450. They're awesome, you guys. Okay, so I see Pearl. Thank you, Pearl. Okay. And then I see Becky wants three, so let me just see if we can get to everybody, Becky. But you definitely have one right now, Becky. And Kay would like one. Thank you, Kay. Okay. And if no one else, Becky would get the last one. So, Becky, you would get two of those. Okay. 
Okay, so the last piece of this that I have is a yard plus, however, in length, you know, in, in size, it's a yard plus, a little over a yard. But there is a good chunk out of it. Okay, so here's here's the yard, okay? And then at the half yard point on one side, at the half yard point on one side only, there is a fat quarter about taken out of. Okay? So that's what that is. So there's still a lot of material here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do $7 to the first person on this one. Thanks, Kay. And there's just that left of that one. But it'll go to the first one. Okay, Becky. All right, thanks ladies. Okay, let's move on to the next one. What else do I have? Okay, uh, okay, these are just over a half yard. These are vintage Christmas fabrics. Um, so these are just over a half yard. They've been washed, so they're frayed at the bottom. What else show you? Oh, it didn't like that. It did not like that at all. Let's try that again. That's the print. It's super cute. And it's like a, it's a cotton. It's a really nice Christmas green. Oh, I think it's showing it better now that it's laying down. And again, this is just over a half yard. So those are going to be $3. And there's just two of those. As well, just so when I create journals, you have to. I don't care. I just do YouTube. That's it. Yeah. Unfortunately, I'm sorry. Yeah, I wish I did, but um, it's just too much for me. So I just do YouTube. That's it. But you're always welcome to add my channel or my email address to share. That is, you know, you're more than welcome to add that information. Okay, so one is going to Tammy M. Thank you, Tammy. And one is going to Becky. Thanks, Becky. Yeah, awesome, Kay. Thanks so much for doing that, too. That's so sweet of you to, to do that. So thank you. Okay, I do have another... I have a couple of Christmas ones, so we'll just do those right now. Okay, so this is the next Christmas one. Just my little notes. I think these are just under. Maybe these are just under. I'm going to say just under just to be safe, just under a half yard. But we'll do A and B. Um, and they're, they're going to be $3, too. Okay, so you've got A. Again, these are just vintage fabrics, like probably from the 80s, 90s, with the Christmas candy canes. I love those. There's two of those. And then the red Christmas, uh, the red Christmas fabric with the green trees. Really pretty. So here we go. I'm going to put that in. I had notes, you guys, and somehow the notes on each of these got mixed up, so I'm not sure. But I know that they're at least, you know, about a half yard. So there's that. So there is that. Oh my gosh, I'm telling you. I had all this prepped for the week prior, so I like had it in my head or how everything was. And then, you know, it's been like over a week and a half or something and I forgot. Okay, so Becky would like a B and an A. Thank you, 
keep back key. And I'm just gonna refresh to make sure I'm right. Yeah, and then Paula, I'll put P-S-E-N so I don't get that mixed up with the other Paula. Paula would like an A. And that A is gone. B is the only one left. Did anyone want the last B? Thank you. Thank you. My A to Debbie if you have more. I don't. And, um, oh, okay. So you're going to take, to give Debbie A. Okay. So you'll take this one, Paula, the red with the Christmas trees, and then Debbie will get this one. Awesome. Well, that worked out for everybody. Thank you, ladies, for all being so sweet. That was wonderful. Okay, the next fabric I have is not Christmas. No, no, no. <coughs> These are um, 24 by... A, I'm going to say an estimate of 24 by 16 inch piece. Liz, how are you? I'm like choking as I'm talking. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> I need a drink. Okay. Sorry about that. These pieces are about 24 by 16 about. Okay. Um, these came from, from drapes as well that I had taken apart. So here is what, and some of them have a hem on them. Some of them don't. Some of them have one. Some of them have two. It all depends. <clears throat> it is a lovely, lovely green. And then it has almost that like, I'm going to say damask or what is that brocade look? Brocade more than damask, I would say. And then it has the gold running through it as well. I'll try to hold it up so I can show it to you really well. Isn't that pretty? Oh my gosh, you guys. It almost looks like lace on the top of it, doesn't it? Wrapping Nurse Tina. <laughs> Tina's so great. Oh, isn't that pretty, you guys? So it's this awesome green, like almost like a sage green with the gold. And then I think it's brocade is what they call it. Let me show you the backside. So like the backside is almost just as pretty sometimes, right? These are going to be 250. And again, they are 24 by 16. And there's plenty. There's plenty, so I'm gonna put it in, 250. Just let me know however many you want. Ooh, I should probably do this, huh? So you can see it. Let me know however many you want, because I have them. They are super pretty. Okay, Liz is gonna take two. Thank you, Liz. These are nice. So let's see. Let's get Liz's two. There's one, two, and that's for Liz. Thank you, my dear. And then we have Tina T, the wrapping nurse. She's going to take one. Thank you, Tina. Oh, you want two. Got it, Tina. Okay. Thank you, Tina. So there is Tina's two. Okay, after that was Becky. Becky would like two. Thank you, Becky. I'm glad you guys like it. It's really pretty, you guys. It is stuck now. <laughs> it is. I'm going to call her the rapid nurse. Hey, Rebecca. <coughs> I didn't see her pop in. Rebecca. How are you? Okay. Anyone else on that fabric? Before I move on, I'm 
Are we good, ladies? <coughs> um, I'm just trying to think, Liz. There's some stuff that I went over, but I'll go over it again shortly for the people that have, are here that missed it. Because there's not too much, but there's a few things that you guys missed. Anybody else on this one? <coughs> Liz, there was this fabric. Well, I have it right here if you're interested. This is a half yard, and it was $3, I believe, right, guys? Hold on, let me double check. It was $3 for the half yard. Just hold that up, Liz, if you're interested in that one. And I was saying how well it dyes, like coffee dyes. Um, oh, I know how that is, Kay. Okay, so... See what's next. Okay, here's the next fabric. These are 18 by 40. I hope that's right. These were curtains as well. See, I don't think that's right. Hold on. Let me get my tape measure. My tags got all mixed up. These are about 22 and a half. By 42. 22 and a half by 42. Um, these are, again, these, some of them are hemmed. Make it a hemmed piece. Gorgeous blue floral. Isn't that pretty? Oh, I love the muted blue. It's so pretty, the different shades of it. Two, three, four, five. Wait, did I count that one? Two, three, four. There's six of those. Those are four dollars. Not letting me type. Come on. All right, that's in. <clears throat> oh, Liz, that's so nice. You're killing me. <laughs> <coughs> excuse me. <clears throat> oh, my gosh. Excuse me. Okay. Here we go. $4. So we'll do one per person first. I'm refreshing. So Liz gets one. <clears throat> Thank you, Liz. Oh my gosh, you guys, my throat is so dry tonight. And then Debbie Long. Thank you, Debbie. Okay, gets one. Okay, he says, I'm here for this. I am here for this. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> okay, and then after K is Tina. Awesome. Thank you, thank you. After Tina is Tina T. After Tina T is Tammy M. Those are all gone. Thank you, ladies. Hi, Allison. How are you? <clears throat> Excuse me. Those are gone. Okay. Really quick, let me go back through what I have. I have a few things here that I need to go back through. Um, okay, so we're just, I'm going to take out the readers again. Thank you. I know I have coffee right here too. It's just not helping. Um, let me just do the A, B, and C. I have a few readers digest left, and then I'll just do a couple things that we did at the very beginning, which is not much, but for anyone that's just popped in. So we have the brown on brown. Um, gosh. 
I was saying it kind of looks like like mermaid skins, uh, scales. And then it has the cream and gold gilding. That'll be A. These are Reader Digest. They'll be $4. This one has the gold and black dots on the green. B. C has like the grayish bluish background with the grayish bluish stripes and green stripes. Burgundy and this one is starting to come. It has come off this piece right here, but it's it's there. I wanted to actually repair that. That is C. Those are four dollars. Hey, Lois, how are you? Okay, here we go. And I just have one more digest after this. So for anyone that missed them, that was looking for them, there's these three plus one more. That is it. Okay, so Becky is taking B. Thank you, Becky. Susie is taking A. Thank you, Susie. Anybody for C for the stripe? Okay, and I will leave C right here in case anyone changes their mind. It's very pretty. And this is the last one. This is like the tone on tone greens. It's like almost like a mossy green. There we go. And the hunter spine. So I'll leave a, I'll leave C there in case anyone changes their mind. Those are the last two. There we go. Okay, so Liz is taking B. And poor little C is all by, that's the very last Reader's Digest. <laughs> the very last one. Does anybody want that poor little digest? It's all by itself. Anybody? Any okay. Liz says, just give it to me. I'll take it home. I'll give it some love. Thanks, Liz. Okay, all the digests are sold that I have right now. I do not believe I have another one of them. Okay, perfect. Then we did tickets. So the tickets are a dollar, and these are old. These are not new tickets. They are red. Um, and you get a strip of them of 12 so a strip counting one two that way i did not count the second row so in actuality you're getting 24 tickets because they split right apart for a dollar and those are older that's for sure so a dollar for 24 tickets that's in so if anybody would like those, I think those are these are going to be really ooh, great for your Christmas projects to add into um, your Christmas projects for sure with the red tickets. Think about tickets to the North Pole and all sorts of stuff. Okay, Susie. Thank you, Susie. Liz. Thank you, Liz. Okay. Thank you, Kay. Donna. Thank you, Donna. And I have tons of these, you guys. So if you guys want multiples, you're more than welcome. Okay, so Susie, Liz, and thank you ladies so much. Okay, 
and Donna. And Lisa H. Thank you, Lisa. Any other takers on the tickets? Yeah, I still have several packs of those left to share, guys. So if you guys want more, there's still plenty more. Okay, and then the other thing that we did was this trim, and I don't have a lot of that left, but I'll show you it. May I have extras, please? I have plenty, Donna. How many did you want? I can hook you up. This is the trim. It's a yard of fabric and lace. Vintage trim. Isn't that pretty? It's a yard, and that is a dollar. There's not many left of these, but. Um, <clears throat> yeah. You want six? Yeah. Okay, so let me get that first. I'll put this in, and then I'll get Donna's. That's for that. And Donna wants, Donna, you want six more, so you want a total of seven? Ooh, peach moonshine. Donna, Donna, I just want to make sure you want a total of seven. Is that correct? Oh, six altogether. Thank you. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let me just fix that on yours. And thank you, Donna. And thank you, ladies. Okay, Donna, I've got yours. You are all set for your tickets. And I still have, yeah, I still have like one, two, four, five, six, seven. I have like 10 more packs left if anyone wants more tickets, okay? Okay. Okay, so on this one, I have five trims. So I'll do one first and then we'll go back. So Susie. Okay. Rebecca. Hey, Rebecca, did I say hi to you? Hey. Rebecca. Nancy and Paula. So that's four. So the first one that would get a second would be um, Susie. And those are all gone, I believe. Let me double check just to make sure. Yeah, those are all gone. Thank you, ladies. Okay, I'm going to move some stuff out of the way for a quick second. Let's see the basket because we need some room. We need some room, so we're just going to move these over. Fabrics. That's out of the way. All right. <coughs> Susie wants two more tickets. Oh, Liz. Okay, so Susie, I'm putting you down for two more packs of tickets. Thank you very much. Fabulous. Oh, you're so sweet, Liz.
Oh, you don't have stuff like this in New York City? Well, I'm happy to share my goodies. I love sharing with you guys. Okay. Let's do another fabric. There it is. Stuff can be overpriced in New York City as well, right? Okay. This one is about 22 by 23. Is that right? I feel like I have that incorrect. Yeah, if you find them, they're super expensive, right? Yeah, I can usually find some pretty good deals here in New Hampshire. Okay, that was not right, that measurement either. So let me remeasure this. I can usually get a really good deal, and then I can give you guys good deals, you know? All right, this is about 23 and a half inches wide by... 44 and it's so pretty guys so here is the top of it let's do a scroll down kind of a thing okay so here's the top so it's a big panel almost right but there's lots of bits to be cut out look at the keys okay and then it's got the green and the red roses <coughs> Yes, very expensive. And you don't have stuff like this in your part of Australia either. I've heard that, Donna, in Australia. Yeah, I've heard that. Well, I'm happy that I can, you know, help out. Okay, so as we go down the panel, look at just the beautiful flowers. And this is a bird cage, you guys. You ready? You guys see that? Look at the little door on the lock. Isn't it adorable? Absolutely adorable. I love it. And then it finishes off at the bottom as it did at the top, except it's a little different at the bottom. It has believe and enjoy. So lots of things to like fussy cut. Oh, thanks. Um, and there is just one of these puppies around that I have, you guys. Look at that bird cage. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. You get the little bird up there and the keys. Oh, and the, oh, and the bee. So I don't know. Do you guys want to auction this? <coughs> Why don't we auction it? How about we do this? Let's do an auction, an untimed auction. So when you're out, I'm just going to start it at a dollar. When you're out, just let us know that you're out. And as it slows down, I'll do a last call. Sound good? Does every Is everyone familiar with the untimed auctions? only one I know that's why I figured because I only have one and I don't remember you guys did I sell this some of this before because I only ended up with one yeah I'm gonna auction it um just so it's fair for everybody that way they can get their you know their best price and that they want to pay for it um but I usually buy fabric in good amounts you know I usually get a good deal so I'll get a bunch of it and I only had one of these I can't remember if I sold more uh -huh, Angie all right so everyone's good on the no timed auction. All right, here we go. So I'm going to start it. It's not timed. When you're out, just say out. And that way we know it's starting to slow down. There we go. It's in. It's starting at a dollar. Oh, wouldn't it, Tina? I know. Oh, my goodness. Yep, I can see it on lots of projects. I think Donna's thinking bags. I was thinking that too, Donna. Oh, bye, Amanda. Thanks for coming. I'll see you this weekend, I'm sure, on the lives. Um, and, uh, Amanda, don't forget, Care's on tomorrow for our disabled artists doing her monthly auction. It's going to be really fun. She's doing, um, it's no shipping, so it's going to be a lot of classes um, and that sort of thing to sign up for and purchase. So it's going to be really fun. But have a wonderful night, Amanda. Thank you so much for coming, my friend. Okay, so right now, let's see. Um, so Liz has it at five. Liz, Liz was first at five dollars. So if anyone wants it, they would have to go up higher than Liz, but Liz has it at five dollars right now. And you can do quarters, quarters are fine, ladies. So five fifty to Donna. Oh, Liz just took it to seven dollars. So you'd have to go up 
from seven, you could do 725, 750, you can do eight. You'd have to go up from $7. Donna is out. Thank you, Donna. So Liz right now has it at $7. Any other bids? Thank you for letting us know, Donna. I appreciate that. Okay, since it was just the two of them, I'm going to hit last call. You'll have a few seconds to get your very last bids in, and then I will, I'm not going to look, I'm just going to hit stop in just a few seconds. I'm just going to do a little countdown on my own. So your last call is now in. If you want to put any more bids in, right now is your time to get this, you guys. Okay, seconds left. I am not looking at chat. I am just going to hit stop in just a few seconds, and here we go. Okay. And Liz got that seven dollars. Congratulations. Oh, Everyone can still hear me and see me. Oh, my heavens. Oh, oh, Angie, I'm sorry to hear that. Gift to the wrapping nurse, please, from me. Oh, that's so sweet. I'm sure Tina's going to love it. Still here. Thank you, ladies. I don't know what happened there. This is just the internet lately. I'm telling you, it's just killing me. All right, so Liz. $7 gift to Tina T, our rapid nurse. Okay. Such a sweet friend. She sure is. She sure is. I'll tell you what. Liz is a good egg. Okay. Here's the next one. So this one, ooh, this one's so fun. I love this one. There's four available. Okay, so I have four of these available. You're going to get um, eight. I'm, I'm going to call these panels, okay? So when I say eight panels, you're going to get four on one side. And so this is the O and the E, okay? I probably should have showed it this way first. And then four on this side. So it's, it actually spells out love, L-O-V-E. And then the birds are different, of course. Look at how cute they are. I mean, you don't have to spell out love if you don't want to. You can use them in totally different ways. But you do get eight of these panels. Okay, and these will be $4. And there's four available. Yeah, four available. But they are super cute. Look at the O. He's got a letter. She's got a letter. Isn't hey Barbara Hamilton? Isn't that the funniest? Look at her with her little hat on. And then come on. Look at that guy right there. Oh my gosh. Guys, I love these. Let me hold this one up closer. I really should have showed it better. <laughs> it's the flower daisy crown. Oh, she's so cute. And then this guy down here. Sorry, I gotta show it. It's so adorable. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys, I'm telling you, I love it. Okay, so there is four of those available. Okay, Barbara. Thank you, Barbara. Um, you know, those are gone. Did you get one, Tina? Okay, so Barbara's getting one of these. Thank you, Barbara. Lois. He loves me. He loves me. Not exactly. Hey, Lois. Thanks, Lois. 
Okay, and then we have Tina up, and there's one left. Wouldn't it, Barbara? Oh my gosh, I'm telling you. There's one left, ladies. The picture, silly. The, oh, what did you want to say? Hold on, let me read back. Let me look back. Can I see the purple flowers? On here? Oh, I don't, were there purple flowers? Hold on. Oh, I'm sorry, Tina, I'm like, purple flowers. <laughs> there you go. So that's the purple flowers, Tina. And then it's on that one. And then you have another one. And two more on the other side as well. So you have four with purple flowers. I don't know if, what they are, Tina. I'm sorry. But you do have four. You would have um, four of these squares with this flower. I'll hold it up again. Maybe somebody will know. But you do have four of these squares with those flowers. Oh, and that's going to Susie. All right, Susie. Sold. All right, thank you, ladies. I appreciate it. They are just so cute. Susie. That's right. I know you're looking for pansies, right, um, Tina? If I see anything that's specifically pansies, I will sure let you know. Okay, if anyone needs white cotton fabric, that's what this is. And I believe, again, I need to double check because my little measurements are all gone. But it's just white cotton fabric. It is about 18 and a half by 44, 45. So these will be 250, and again, it's just a, it's what the measurements that I've just read, and it's just a cotton fabric, cotton white fabric. Okay, three of those. So these would be great for painting on, stamping on, dyeing. I mean, you name it, you could do it with these. Okay, so Liz, thank you, Liz, and Tina T. Thank you, Tina. Great. Everybody doing okay? I have one of these. It's about, I don't think that measurement's correct either, so I'm going to double check it. You guys, this is awesome for like a carpet bag. It's like 24, 25 inches by, no, yeah, 24, 25 inches by. 26 and look at this material so it's this gorgeous green and then the wine color oh my gosh and then it has the shades of gold running through it it's absolutely beautiful there it is and then the back look at that and this phrase, oh, it phrased so nicely. Awesome. <laughs> so, yeah, this one's really fun, too. I only have one of these. Let's just go ahead and auction it off, just to be fair to everybody. I think I just have one of these um, for now, anyways. We'll do the open-ended auction. I'll start it at a dollar. And you guys just go, let me know when you're done, when you're out. And we'll do it that way. How does that sound? 
may need to open up a new screen. Will you guys do that? If you guys are interested, I'm gonna open up this. What's this is? There we go. Hopefully that's coming in clear. <laughs> Barbara and Tina, I think your pets are cold. Thank you too. <laughs> you guys are so funny. <laughs> oh, I need another sip of my coffee. Oh my gosh, you guys are killing me. Okay, so we have Becky at nine in the lead. Yes, maybe so, but I have a lot. <laughs> oh, what does Rebecca say? Just got home. I had my son fine. Hopefully he got me good stuff, but gotta get in the house. I'll be back. Okay, Rebecca. <clears throat> oh, Tina says, OMG, I need that fabric. You guys are so funny. Okay, Liz has it at 10. Tina is out. I don't know if I knew you cast <laughs> Becky's out. I don't think you ladies like this fabric. Liz says. Okay, it looks like most people are out. I'm going to put last call. Now is your chance to go ahead and, if you want to, put a last bid in. You go to a few seconds. I am not looking and I'm just going to hit stop. Liz does have it at $10 right now. Okay, and here we go. So let me just do a quick refresh. And Liz gets it at 10. Congrats, Liz. And thank you. Very well done, ladies. Well done. All right, let's see what's next. <laughs> yeah, ugh, yeah it's so ugly. You guys thought about it. All right, these are about 16 by 26. These are a little, no, gosh. Oh, this piece is, okay. These are 18 by 24. And there's three of these. Okay, so let's do this one first. <clears throat> these are vintage for sure again I can, these are 18 by 26 about okay, I need to go back to stream nerd I can't tell you exactly what kind of fabric this is um, but I'm going to hold it up real close and it feels again like that canvasy feeling but softer than canvas a lighter <clears throat> weight but I'm going to hold it up nice and close. It could be twill. It could be, I don't know. I just, I don't know, but it is softer than a regular, um, I don't think it's linen. It doesn't feel like linen to me, but it does have the red edging on each end. So you have it down on each end. Okay. It's very pretty. The material is really very, very pretty. Um, so again, these are about 18 by 26. There are three of those available and those will be 350. Looks like linen, looks like linen. It might be, you guys. I'm just, I'm not a fabric expert. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and refresh over here to make sure who got it. You know what? I'm going to put a sticky. That's what I'm going to do on here. So. It was Becky, Tina T, and Liz. Now, thank you, ladies. I do have one more piece of this. However, it is not as big. Oh, 
Okay, so the the other piece that I have is 16 by 26. So it's two inches shy than the other one. Um, and so what I'll do is just do 250 on this last piece because it is, oh gosh, it is smaller by two inches. It's by Pretty Fabric, right? Just by Pretty Fabric. So there's that one left if anyone is interested in that guy. Let me get rid of some of these scraps. And who got that one? Let me refresh. And it was Tina too. All right, thank you, ladies. What else do I have for you? I have linens. I'll <laughs> share some of these backpacks. Okay. Oh, you know what? Before we do linens, let's do these. I have two scrap bags. And they basically all have very similar items, very similar fabrics, as you can see. Um, but they are scraps. They are in the gallon size bags. So there's a good amount in here. Do you want me to take them out or do you want me to just say the price and go? Shall I take them out? Shall I just say the price and go? You guys tell me if anyone's interested. Sure. So let's go ahead. They're all, they're both very similar. Um, so what you see in one is very similar to what you're going to see in the next one. Some may vary just a little bit. Like this one has a small piece of this plaid. Okay. Um, there is a small piece of, th there's two pieces of this one with like the brocade. There's two pieces of that. There's some littler pieces there. This is like a silk and not silk, um, that like crushed velvet feeling on that sheer material. Oh, it's beautiful, you guys. It's so gorgeous. But there's another good piece in the other one as well. It's so pretty. There is a B square, and I think there's two of these in each embroidery piece. There is a piece, a small piece of this fabric from earlier. <clears throat> there's this one um the other one and the other bag is different there is pieces of this pieces of the toile in pink pieces of the toile in blue this each has a good chunk of this dog fabric in each one of them there is a good piece of this in each of them. There is a uh, flannel, which is really fun for fall. There's that one, and there's a few pieces. So this is a long strip. So they're all different sizes, different shapes, lots to play with. There's this, this is really pretty. Look at that. And that's doubled. There's another piece of that. There's more of this. There is this like um, gray tweed with the pinstripe. There's a big piece of that. There is this like black and white lace. More plaid. There's a nice chunk there. Um, like upholstery. More upholstery. And these will vary in the bags. <laughs> So, oh yeah, okay, yeah. 
So that's what's in the bags. About, like I said, they, you know, each bag is very similar. A few pieces may be different, but for the most part, you know, they're, they're very similar bags. Give me a quick sec to get everything back in this bag. There is a lot. Okay, so that's that. So like I said, there's a good amount in each bag. They're going to be um, $6.50 a bag, and there's only two. <clears throat> so there's that. Okay, so Susie gets one, and Tina T. Way to go, girls. Just smeared my ink all over me. Hold on. Okay. Thank you, ladies. All righty. Yeah, lots of yummies, right? All right, so there's that. The fabric. We've done, I've showed you all the fabric. The only pieces that I still have left are these and these. So if anyone is wanting either of those or more, let me know while I grab the next thing, okay? Um, let's see here. Lurking in my back. You lurk away, girl. Okay, so we're all set with these. I'm going to move these out of the way. <clears throat> so we have a goodie box. And it's stuffed full, so the cover doesn't even want to stay on it right now. But it does go on it perfectly. Um, let's show you. Let's see. Here we go. So it's one of these textured boxes, which is so fun to work with. That's the size of it. And this one is Christmas related. So you've got some really pretty Christmas tissue. Okay, let's open it up. So, in this box we have, 
one of these super, super cute little um, metal mailboxes. It's got the little flag that says Merry Christmas. It has the vintage pictures on it. It's absolutely adorable. And here is the front of it. Here is the other side. It's so cute. And it was... Um, That one. Isn't that cute though? Inside you have two brand new um, uh, washi rolls. I had to take them out of their package because the packaging was so bulky. But these are two brand new washi rolls that say no peeking. And they have the snowflake and it just repeats itself, no peeking. And you have two of those, okay? And then in that mailbox was also this red trim. It's really pretty. It'd be great for Christmas trim. Oh, I taped it. I taped it. And I don't remember how big this was. Let's see. Let's see. This one is about 23 inches. And here's what it looks like. Let's see if I can try to hold it off to show it to you. There we go. Is that focusing? So it's got like the fringe and then the tassels and then like the braiding at the top. So that is in there. Good night, Allison. Yeah, the box is really fun. Especially if you do like mixed media, that would be a really fun box to play with. Um, but I figured this box, I would fill with Christmas goodies or related Christmas goodies, right? And then I will do those last. You have a whole pack of um, button envelopes, all like vintage button envelopes. Can you see them here? And there's a lot. And then Tons of buttons, all sorts, all sorts of button envelopes and buttons. There is also a pack of these um, five gift enclosures with envelopes or little Christmas cards with the envelopes. There is also a red and a white seam binding. Those are vintage. And then you've got these three. You've got this one. These are absolutely gorgeous ornaments. Can you guys see how pretty those are? Oh, okay. Yes. Um, well, I have linen 2K. I haven't done the linen yet, um, but you want one of these. I think these were 250, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay, okay, I'll put your name on one of these. I do have linen that I haven't gotten to yet. Thanks, Kay. Oh, okay. <coughs> gotcha. Okay. <coughs> so there's that one. They're really well made. And just beautiful embroidery all throughout. So it's a set of three. So you get that one. I'll get this one. There's the wings. And this one.
those pretty. They have like the Christmas wreaths around their necks. They're so pretty. So all of the goodies with the box, we'll auction it off. You ready? Well, you probably can't see everything. Here. You probably can't see it all. Okay, how's that? Better? All right, so we're going to auction. It's going to be an open-ended auction. And go. Oh, that's okay, Kay. No worries. So that is the end, guys. So if anyone's interested in that goodie box, it's an open-ended auction. And Tina has it at five, Barbara's at six. And while you guys do that, and just let us know when you're out, um, I will try to put it back. I don't remember how I had it. Hmm. I wonder if I can lay these down. I didn't have a very good enough way because I couldn't even get the cover back on it. I had it so packed. Huh. Maybe. If I did this. Like that. What if I leave that there? Hold on. Try to talk myself into figuring this out better. Because I don't think I just I had it in good enough. Yeah, I think I could do this better. If I do that. Ha ha. Oh yes. Well, I don't think it's still gonna close. It wants to. It's so full. It's so full. It wants to close, but it's just it's gonna give me trouble. I'll make sure it's secured for whoever purchases it. Don't worry. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'll make sure it's good, you guys. But yeah. There you go. Anywho. <laughs> So there's that goodie box. Okay, so what do we have? Uh, Liz is in the lead at 12.25. Way to go, ladies. So you'd have to go higher than 12.25 right now. And let us know when you're out, girls. Any other bids? Liz has it at 12.25. All right, I don't see any more movement here, so let me hit last call. So right now Liz has it at 12.25. I'm gonna give it a few seconds before I hit stop. If you wanna get another bid in, now is the time. Okay, Lisa has it at 13. Does it have to go higher than 13 right now? And Liz is out. Thank you, Liz. And let's stop. Okay. And that is going to Lisa H for $13. Well done, ladies. Congrats, Lisa. I will have that all secured for you. Okay. Let's see what's next. <coughs> Excuse me. Mm. I have got the cutest calendar, you guys, and I am going to open it because it's half open. And then we'll do a linen lot. It's called Memory Lane, 
a collection of nostalgic prints for 1991. Do you not love that little picture? Oh my gosh, it's so cute. You're welcome, Lisa. So, oh gosh, you guys, these are the sweetest pictures. I had to open it to show you. How am I going to do this? Like that? Yeah. So there's that one. I'm just going to flip right through. Because each of them is so precious. You just have to see these. I love them. I love them. Huh. That one doesn't have one. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at this one. Look at her. Isn't that the sweetest? Oh my gosh. I Every picture is like, I think it's just going to get better, but uh, it can't get better and it does. Look at this one. Oh my gosh, they're so adorable. There's that one with the dog. Look at her. They're pinks. So adorable. And oh, and then there's that one. That, that was the cover. Love that one. <laughs> Little bums trying to heat up. It's so cute. And that's it. And then the back has all of them. Um on it as well so you could cut out the back too so there's that let's go ahead and auction that guy off too we'll leave it open-ended and you're out just let us know that you're out and that is for that guy Okay, let's see. Barbara has it at three. Liz is at four. Barbara's back at six. And I'm going to keep this cardboard in there. So Barb has it at six dollars in the lead right now, ladies. I have to go higher than six. Any other bids? If you ladies are out, just let us know that you're out. Okay, Liz is out. Thank you, Liz. <clears throat> I, I don't see much more movement, so I'm going to go ahead and hit last call. I'll give it a few seconds and hit stop. Get your last bids in if you want to go higher than six dollars. All right, getting ready to hit stop. Stop. Okay, let's refresh. And that is going to Barbara for six dollars. Way to go, Barbara. Well done. Okay, do you guys want to do some linens? Okay, so we're going to do... Um, oh, you did? Oh. <clears throat> we're going to do a lot of um, linens. It'll be an auction. So here's the first piece. So this is like... Um, <coughs> Excuse me, this is like a wheat embroidery. You hold that up. And this is a round piece with a scallop. Look how pretty that is. Oh, it's all scalloped. There are some um, aging issues here. There's some little 
runs right there. But for the most part, it's an awesome shape. So there's that piece. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's the hole, like a little hole. Okay. Then let's see what we have. Why don't we do? I know some pieces are matching. We are going to do this little tea towel, and it has the embroidery silhouette in black, and that is in excellent condition. So there's that. We will also do, oh, this one is so pretty. This is another towel, more of a kitchen towel size, and it has that embroidery on it at the bottom. Look at how pretty those flowers are. And that goes all the way across the bottom when it's opened. Okay. So there is that one. Let me try to fold it back up. So there's that. And let's go ahead and add. What are we going to add in there? What are we going to add? These are, hold on, I don't want to, hold on a second. These are not the same. Okay, these are very similar, um, but one is more discolored, but I think they're the same pattern. So these would be like hankies. <clears throat> um, and here is the edging. I have it right side up. No, it should be that way. No, it should be that way. Okay. So here is the edging and it's a very thin linen. Let's see if that'll pick that up. Nope. Done. It doesn't like it. Come on, pick it up. Here we go. Okay, okay, thank you. So there's those two. Again, there's like a tiny little hole there, one there. The edging on this one is a little bit more yellowed than this one. Okay. But those two are the same pattern. So there's those two. There's that. There's that big one. And we are going to add in this piece, <clears throat> which is absolutely gorgeous. So let's move that out of the way. Look at this one with the cut work and then the trim. And there's the trim. Let's see. Isn't that beautiful? Oh my gosh. Look, it shows. Oh, it's so pretty. And this one does have some aging on it as well, but it's very old. So you're going to have that one, this large round one with the wheat, these two that match, the larger linen towel that's embroidered. And the smaller one with the cameo. Okay. Um, so let's go ahead and auction this. I'll leave it unkind. We'll start this one at seven and go. When you're out, you're out. Just let us know. And that is in. Anyone want to start us off? Okay, Barbara's got it at seven. Thank you, Barbara. And I'm just going to start kind of packing it back up here. So 
So Barbara has it at seven dollars. Any other bids? Okay, I'm going to hit last call. I don't see any movement, so I'm going to hit last call. Your last bit's in if you want to get one in. And stop. Okay, it looks like Barbara got that lot for $7. What a steal, Barbara. That's awesome. Congrats. Congrats, congrats. Got yourself a great deal. Okay. Shall we do another little, you're welcome, Barbara, little goodie box, goodie tin. So this one has apples on it, and it has more of that Christmas feel to it because it's got the holly, but it's not Christmas themed inside, but it has like a baskety look to the tin. I had a good price. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. The Finnabar stuff that I got from May will be my first Finnabar stuff. I don't know. Okay, so when you open this up, <clears throat> in here, you have a the cutest little um, lamb stamp, and it's like brand, I think it's brand new. Isn't that awesome? Oh, thanks, Liz. So if you're doing anything like farm related, or really anything. I mean, this would be perfect for that. Um, but it does look brand new. And then you have a whole bag of Scrabble tiles, like a bunch of them, of the wooden Scrabble tiles. I didn't count them. I just shoved as many in the bag as I could. And then you have the wooden spools. So there's this one. And that's a larger one. There's this one. That one has like the numbers on it. And that one. And then there are several of this size. So there we go. So that's what's in this little tin. I know, I can't wait to get this stuff. Does the can have a barcode on it? On here? Um, oh, it says it's from Avon. The can or the stamp? The can, I think. It's from Avon. It says from Avon. Yeah, I can't wait to get mine, Liz. I'm so excited. The tin, yeah, no, no, no code. Okay, so there's everything that you'll get. And we'll start that off at a dollar and go. Oh, that's for everything, guys. So, open ended auction, let us know when you're done. I'm going to just start packing everything again. You get the whole bag of Scrabble tiles, which is a ton, and then all of these fabulous spools. And your cute little lamb stamp.
we'll get them all back in there. We'll get them in there. Yeah, some of the spools are super old. A lot of them are old, but some of them are even, you know, just really, really old. Let's see if we can get this guy back in here. He doesn't want to go back to his little home. Hold on. He is going. We are making him go. He's not staying. We got him. Liz, your bed is calling. You guys are so funny. All right, where are we at? Barbara has it at six. We want to go higher than six. Oh, the goodness. <laughs> you guys are so funny. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Six twenty five to Liz, seven to Barbara. Barbara has it in the lead at seven dollars. Does anyone want to go higher? You are getting very sleepy. <laughs> So Barbara has it at seven. You'd have to go up seven twenty-five, seven fifty. If you wanted to stay in, <laughs> bed rest for you. <laughs> she said that isn't gonna work. She has her laptop. She's good to go. <laughs> oh, you better get that seven twenty-five in there. <laughs> there she goes. Oh my gosh. Okay, Liz has it at 7.25. She's not giving up. She's not giving up. <laughs> Barbara has it at 9. <laughs> I have a laptop that goes to back up. I'm sorry, Liz. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Barbara has it at 9. Anyone want to go higher? 9.25, 9.50, 9.75, $10. Just let me know when you're out. All right, I'm going to hit last call. And Liz says she is out and she is going to sleep. <laughs> hit stop. Okay, okay, and it's a stop. That is going to Barbara for nine dollars. Congrats, Barbara! Yay! Well done. Well done. Okay, what else do we have for you? What else do I have? Oh, you know what? We do have these Christmas rub-ons. We could do these. These are rub-ons. Chris oh, let me go back here. Um, Christmas rub-ons. They're by American Traditional Designs. And they're super cute. So there's two sets of them. There is this one. Let's see if that really shows it. Hmm. See, so there's these. These are the snowmen. There's only one set of these. It does not want to focus and play nice. Just let it snow. Then you have the three snowmen up here. The wreaths, the little snowmen, all up here. Super cute. And then on the back, it shows you. Um, it's called Let It Snow, and it has like the popsicle stick to rub them on, and it shows you how to do it. So it gives you the directions. 
So that one will be A. And again, there's only one of A. And then there's two of the one with the candy cane. So this one is called Happy Holidays. Um, and it's got the presents, obviously, the candy canes, the um, holly. I love those candy canes. And again, the same thing on the back. It gives you the directions. It gives you the stick. So there's two of those, and those will be D. And these will be $1.50. Excuse me. Oh, that's kind of crooked, huh? That's kind of crooked. So this is for the rub-ons. Anybody for the rub-ons? Is it Robins? That's okay. Okay. Um, the next thing I have are these. And these are the playing cards that were five by sevens. Oh, Susie, you wanted one. Susie, you wanted. Susie, you wanted the snowman. Gotcha. Thank you, Susie. So there are the candy canes left. Thanks so much. <clears throat> okay. So. Oh, God, I'm wrinkling my stuff. Okay. These are the playing cards. I'm going to go back here. That were the size of a five by seven. These are older. Um, show you the print. It's really pretty. It's very pretty blues and grays. And these would make awesome covers themselves. Um, so, like, that's one of them. That's one of them. They all look, you know different but like I said they are older so they're not in perfect perfect shape um, but they are really cool try a cherry on top for supplies they may have what's a cherry on top Ooh. um so these are five by sevens. Again, they're two for a dollar, and these make perfect, perfect size journal covers, you know, to make the actual journal itself. So they are two for a dollar. And I have plenty of sets. If anyone's interested in those, we have those. Cherry tops are more expensive. Oh. Okay, so Liz wants these are two for a dollar. Okay, Liz is getting three sets. Well, yeah, we'll just let's see. I think they really got mixed. Okay, one. Well, it doesn't matter. I can do it after. I mix them up and do it after. Okay, so Liz is getting three sets. Barbara. Is getting a set. <laughs> oh, Barbara wants two. Got it, Barbara. Becky is getting three sets.
power is n power is getting two sets. Thank you, ladies. Okay, any other takers? There's still more left. Three, six, seven, eight, ten. There's still plenty left. So if anyone wants any more, let me know. And thank you, ladies. Cherry on top. I'm going to have to write that down. Cherry on top. I'll have to look at that. Do you have the Queen of Hearts? Um, I don't know if they do. Queen. Yes, I have the Queen of Hearts. Two more for Liz. So Liz, you're going to get five. Got it? Okay, so that's... Got it. Anyone else before I move the cards out of the way? And thank you, ladies, so much. Those are fun. Those are really cool. We had the coins. Okay. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna have a craft lunch. We are gonna have a craft lunch. It's gonna happen. Prepared. Okay, so these are. I'm not 100% sure <clears throat> if these were like poker chips. They are older for sure. And they've been used for sure. And they they kind of like sound like a ceramic. If you guys know for sure, let me know. But these would be really cool um, in mixed. Can you hear this? Um, in mixed, they're definitely not plastic, in mixed media or to make charms out of, to use the centers, um, to decoupage and use bales on them. See, they're very old and they feel like ceramic, but don't poker chips normally have like a picture or a number on them? I don't know, but they're like, are they melamine? I don't know, Becky. They sound like like a porcelain, but I mean, I don't know. Maybe they are melamine. I don't know. But I thought these would be really fun to use in some projects as far as, or celluloid, maybe they are. Yeah, to use for like cameos, decoupage, and do bales. Um, all sorts of fun things, right? So you get one, two, three, five, six, seven. You get ten in a pack. Okay, cool, Becky. Um, so you get 10 in a pack, and there'll be a dollar fifty to anyone that's interested. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's eight available. Those would be fun to play with, I think. Okay, so let's see. Lisa. H. Thank you, Lisa. Okay, Becky. 
Thank you, Becky. There's still six left if anyone wants one or wants more. Oh, Liz is taking three. Thank you, Liz. Yeah, I think this would be really fun to play with to make some charms out of. So there's three left. <coughs> Tina T. Two left. And the last two are going away to Hartman. Sold. Thank you, ladies. Very good. Okay, so the next thing, thank you, ladies. Thank you. Sold, sold. The next thing I have for you is this pack of um, paper birds. Um, so I took it out of its box, but it's here's the um, it's called Beautiful Paper Birds, Easy to Make, Lifelike Models. Here's the book. And at <laughs> the end, it says, Have fun with the little bird. Um, it just goes through the steps on how to make it, and the templates are in here. And it's even how to make the houses, too. So in here is all of it. And someone, at one point, it looks like started to make one, but, like, here's one of them. See all the pieces, and then you would just, um, you would just cut these out and then follow the directions. But like here's pieces too, like the um, the bird house itself. More bird. See that would go together. Okay, so it's it's all that kind of stuff, all different kinds. More different kinds. So that is what this is. It's a whole paper bird kit. Okay, and we're gonna start this at $3. If anyone's interested, we'll do an auction. Open-ended. And just let us know when you're out. Good luck, ladies. Oh, I need to refresh on here. Hold on. My YouTube now is way far behind. Let's see what's going on, shall we? There we go. Okay. So that's in. Oh, Angie, you do fine. <coughs> Liz has it at three. Thank you, Liz. Any other bids? <coughs> Excuse me. Be a fun set to play with. I'm going to give it a few more seconds. I just see Liz so far, guys. And thank you, Liz. Any other bits? Any other bits? I'm going to hit the last call. I see no activity. So, two seconds, and I'm going to hit stop. So, if you want to get that, get your last bit in. And get ready for your stop. Stop. Okay, let's refresh. Susie is our sniper. Susie got it at three fifty. Way to go, Susie! Way to go, Susie got that. Congrats! All right, 
I have an ideals, um, the gift of friendship book. It is an ideals book. And um, here it is, an ideals book. Have you guys ever seen the ideals book? I've got the magazines, but I've never seen the book. No focus. Okay. So I thought this was super cool. This paper is amazing. Look at how pretty this is. Oh, gosh. I got to put something underneath it. Okay, you guys, it's so pretty. I mean, it's a nice big book and it is full. Look at these gorgeous pictures, you guys. Oh my gosh. So pretty. So it is an ideal hardcover, an ideals, excuse me, hardcover book. And it is just gorgeous. Um, look at that picture, it's so pretty. So we're gonna start this one. We're gonna auction again. We're gonna start it at $4. Let us know when you're out. And we'll go from there. Good luck, ladies. Liz has it at $4. Thank you, Liz, for starting us off. Does anyone want to go higher than four? You have a lot of the hardcover. I've never seen the hardcover ones, Tammy. I have the magazines, but I've never seen the hardcover book. Hold on, guys. Well, you guys do what you're going to do. I'm going to mute for one second. Sorry guys, okay, where are we at? She is upstairs yelling down to me. Oh wow, Tammy. Okay, so Liz has it at four, anyone else? I'm gonna hit last call. Okay. Look out for the snipers. I'm gonna give it a few seconds and I'm gonna hit sold. Wow, Tammy, I didn't even know they had them. This is the first time I ever found one. Okay, let me refresh. And that's going to Liz for $4. Way to go, Liz. Congrats. It's a beautiful book. It really is. Just as pretty, if not prettier, than the, the magazines. Okay, the next one I have is a French book. Um, it's a course, it's an elementary course in French. So here's what the cover looks like. And this one, somebody's written 1964, 1965, and some notes here back from Twinkle Wiggins, freshman, October 19th, 1964. Oh, that's funny. Um, let me see what the year is. So it's 1964 is the year. Oh, hey, Kay. <laughs> Welcome back. <laughs> okay. So again, it's 1964. It's a French elementary book. Okay. 
So you're going to have really sweet little images. And I'm going to do, you've got the glossary in the back, and it is French to English. In the back. So you've got quite a bit of that. Um, and then you have tables. I think of how to conjugate the verbs. So I'm guessing, yeah, third conjugation. Um, and then all the different lessons. You even have music. And again, it's all in French. Some more images. Got like the colored images. Making those basket magazines. Ah, okay. Gotcha, Tammy. So these are all lessons in French and just really cute images. Somebody wrote that. Yeah, they wrote that in there. So I'm going to just do five dollars to the first me on that one. It'll just be a flat five dollars. If anyone's interested in that one. Okay, that's going to Lisa. Congrats, Lisa. Okay, and then this one is a Webster's Student Dictionary. This is an older one for sure. I couldn't find a date, but you guys, it is used like crazy. The spine's coming away from it. Um, it's like a fabric material. But yeah, I couldn't find the year. I'm going to look one more time, but... I'm pretty sure I'm not going to see it. Yeah. So there's no year, but it, I mean, I can tell you it's an older one for sure. Here's the spine. Let me just show you what I mean by it's coming apart. See? And look at this plate right here as I just open up to the wildflowers of America. Isn't that gorgeous? So pretty. Um, that's what the end pages look like. And there are images throughout, of course, the dictionary. Let's see what this plate is here. Oh, and a birds as well. So you have the birds and the flowers. Of course, it just has the regular dictionary images throughout it. Very nice. Planes. I don't see any more of those colored plates, though. It looks like just those two. From what I can see, unless I'm missing it. Nope. Is it a flag one? I could be skipping it, too. I don't know. That was the birds. Oh, there's another one. Dogs. So there's definitely lots of some nice plates in there. Hey, Julie, how's it going? Here's my sister. Okay. Do you guys want me to auction it or flat price it? I don't think it's coming in clear right now.
Julia, the girls watching? Are they sleep? Oh, they're probably sleeping, huh? All right. So on this one, I am going to. You do, Barbara. Isn't it cool? I'm going to flat price this one for anyone that's interested for seven dollars. Yes. Yep. That's Julie. Yep. She's my sister. Um, seven dollars to the first me on this one. Oh, and that's going to Liz. Way to go, Liz. Thank you, thank you, ladies. Okay. Um, I'm trying to think. Oh, you know what I do have? Okay, so for anyone, I know some of you ladies are into the... Um, Western Asian inspired wear. You know, Julie also. Oh, that's awesome. I didn't know that, Barbara. Um, <clears throat> so these are like, I'm going to say like the authentic wear of which area. I'm not 100%. Um, but I will show you the tag and maybe you can tell me. Maybe you know. Someone out there in chat would know. Let's see. Hold on. There we go. There's the tag. Does anyone know what language that is? Or does anyone? Oh, Julie. Yeah, my Julie is younger than me, too. That's so funny. Anyone familiar with that or familiar with these symbols? Because these are their gowns. These are like, to me, they look like traditional like gowns. Um, Vietnam, Donna. Thank you. Well, she's not that young, Angie. <laughs> she's still an adult. So to me, these look like they would be like a, the traditional garb, right? That they would wear. Um, they button, actually, let me show you this way. Okay. This is the bottom. They are so beautiful. Okay, so here, let's do it from bottom to top. It'll be easier for me to show you. Okay, so there is a large split running from, let's see, just under the chest all the way down, okay? Just so you know that. So that's why the material is split. So you would wear something underneath this. I'm assuming they would have some piece that goes underneath this. But these are the pieces. Look at how pretty these, these pieces are. Let's see if I can hold this up better. Aren't those gorgeous? And then like this one even has like some glitz to it. They are so smart. This win. Oh, okay. I think Vietnam. Okay. So I'm going to pan going upwards. Okay. So look at the colors. It's got like this kind of variegated ombre effect of colors in here. Let's go up. I'm just going to show you each section. Okay. And this is like, this is like a teal. And this is like a, a light mauve, I'm going to say. And it almost turns into a brown <clears throat> at some point. Okay. As we go up, so there's nothing, there's no, there's none of like the embroidery pieces or those special pieces right here in the center. And then we go to the top. This is the top. And it splits. That's where it splits on each end. Okay. So that's how it splits apart at the bottom. And look at these pieces, so pretty. And then it opens, I'm just trying to close it up, um, like this. So here's the collar. So it would go here, 
and then here, and then it would button all the way across there. And then the sleeves. have the pieces right around the wrist on both of the sleeves. So I guess we can auction this one first and then do the other one. Let's do one at a time just to keep it simple. Thank you. I don't know what type of fabric this truly is because the language is not a language that I know. There are no other labels in here that I see. Um, I don't know. It's not silk. It must be some kind of a blend. Um, I don't know. I, I'm not 100% sure. I wish I could tell you what it is, but I don't know. All right, so let's auction it, you guys. We'll start it at 10, and we'll do an open auction. When you're done, just let us know that you're out. And let me get over here, and that's it. So that is for that one, which we think is Vietnam, but we're not 100% right. Hi, Angie. <laughs> Anyone want to start us off at 10? Donna says 100% Vietnam. Perfect, Donna. Thank you. <coughs> Donna knows. And Donna, do you know if, I mean, because some of the men wear things like this. Would this be worn by a man or a woman? And do you know for what kind of occasion? curious. So that's in ladies. It's starting at $10 if you were interested. Oh, you're raising your hand. You may go, Angie. <laughs> uh, you may go to the bathroom. I'm so funny. Oh, Natalie says it up there. That's a popular Asian name. Oh. See, any interest, ladies? Are we passing? Is anyone interested in the other colored one? Or are we passing completely? And that's fine. Just let me know either way. Oh, Sharon is in at 10. Thank you, Sharon. And, okay, Barbara says pass. Thanks, Barbara. I appreciate that. And then Lisa says 10 also. People wear them every day. Very ornate French influences. Ah, Donna's so smart. Thank you, Donna. Well, there we go. We have the info right there from Donna. And vintage. Oh, Sharon brought it to 12. Thank you, Sharon. So if you would like it, you'd have to go higher than 12 right now. Welcome back, Angie. Does anyone want to go higher than 12? Oh, I see, Donna. I bet he has all sorts of stories. 
and all sorts of wonderful information. You're welcome. <laughs> I know. Okay, I'm going to hit last call. Now's the chance to get any last bids in. Just get your last bids in. Get them in now. Lisa is at 13. Last call is in. Giving it a few seconds, and then I'm hitting stop. And here comes your stop. And that is going to Lisa for $13. Congrats. Travel the world many times. Wow, so cool. So cool. I'll have that folded up nicely for you, Lisa. Congratulations. <coughs> Let me just fold it like that. I don't lose the sticker. All right. That does sound amazing. Um, if anyone is interested in this one, it is the same type of deal, except these are the prints on it instead. Okay, so I'm just going to pop this one in for 13. We'll just do 13 for this one to the first me, if anyone wants it. And that's for that one. Anybody for that one? I'm just going to give it a second just because the lag is so bad. Not for me. I stayed home with the kids. Oh. Okay. Anybody for this one for 13? Let me give it another second. And I want to move it out of the way. Okay. That one is still available. All right. Thank you, lady. Oh. Lisa's going to take it. Okay, Lisa. You're getting them. Lisa. Well done, Lisa. You got yourself some beauties. I'll get those folded up. Really pretty for you. Okie doke. What else do we have for you? We have another goodie box for you. Thank you, Lisa. Okay. Goodie box. You ready? So this one has got a pink cut. This is a wood box. It's got a pink cover. It's got the metal hardware, the white bottom. So you could paint it whatever color you wanted. But it is painted pink and white. Can you can target. Who's there? Okay, so again, it has the metal hardware that goes up like that. And let's see what we put in here. We put in a tiny book. This is Moss Pillows Rosemary Wells. Covers the same. It's a really cute little book. But a lot of people like just like the covers, but it's a really sweet picture book. Sweet um, illustrations. So there's that. We've got um, a pack of coin envelopes. Is there 10? Let's see. One, two, three, four. I think there's about 10 in there of the coin envelopes. This is a box of um, cardstock. All cardstock pieces, all different colors, 
like that one even looks like a handmade one. All different colors of um, cardstock and prints. Well, not really prints, but like stripes and everything. So you've got that, and there's a good amount of cardstock in there. Really pretty. And then, let's see if I can get this closed. Oh my goodness, close, please. Oh, we'll fiddle with it later. Okay, there's that. This is a bag of all sorts of jewelry bits. Um, some broken, some just charmed, but just all sorts of jewelry bits in there. Another pack of jewelry. This has got shells and wooden beads. Shells and wooden beads. This is another pack of um, the button pockets, the old button pockets, and then a whole bunch of buttons at the bottom. You can see a whole bunch of buttons, the threads, and then all of those. We've got some. Some rick rack, some hem facing, a package of the little flower rosettes. We have a package of brads, keys, a key, a gold, big gold key, a bunch of gold, silver, and white brads, and then some sugar dots, and then the blue sparklies and silver hearts, a whole bunch of stuff in there. This is a glass bottle of like confetti um, with a cork on it. Um, what do you call it? Not glitter, but more of like a confetti kind of a thing for like a shaker card. So there's that. Another bias tape. You've got, oh, these are um, page flags. They're just cute. And the last thing in here is this really cute owl. Um, fabric applique. So that's that. That's everything in here. This will be the last auction uh, item for the night. It'll start at $5 and then we'll do the giveaway after this. It'll be an open-ended auction. That's for everything here. And I'm just going to put this back together a bit. Perhaps you're going to get lots and lots of goodies in here for sure. And that is a glass bottle, so I'll have to wrap that really carefully. Got lots of jewelry, lots of button goodies, all the cardstock. Can't get this to go back in. There we go. that okay so it looks like it's not sequins they're more of like I don't know not it's not sequins it's not um, glitter but almost like a can like a silvery confetti I'm gonna say does that make sense Hey, Jean, how are you? Oh, no pennies, please. Please, ladies. <laughs> please. Tammy says, okay, $8. So $8 is the highest bid. I have to go higher than eight. Thank you, ladies. I'm not sure. 
Oh, that's okay, Jean. You can talk while the ding's happening. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, Tammy has it at eight. Yes, let me see how many tickets there are. Three, two, three, four. Donna, there's nine packs left. Do you want all nine? And then Tammy has it at eight. I'm going to hit last call. Get your last bids in. Okay, Donna. Okay, so Donna. Times nine. Got it, Donna. And Donna, I may just take them out of the baggies to make it like less sh on shipping for you. We'll see how we can do to minimize your shipping. Okay, Liz has it at 850. 10 to Tammy. You have to go higher than 10. <clears throat> 10 25 to Liz. Oh, and thank you, Donna. 11 to Tammy. I'll give it some extra time since you guys are still actively bidding. Okay. Send to Johnny. Please add to my... Yes, I certainly will. Absolutely. Okay. Liz, just let us know when you're out. Let's just... You and Tammy battling it out right now. Are we good? All right, I'm going to give it a few seconds. Oh, they're still going. Okay. Liz has it at 11.50. 13 to Tammy. Liz, did you want to take it high? Oh, I hit stop. I'm sorry. Did you want to take it higher, Liz? I'm going to let it keep going until they're done. Tammy has it at 13. Liz, just let us know if you're out or if you're going to keep going. Okay. So I'm going to hit last call again, <laughs> just to be fair, I'm give it about 10 seconds and then I'm hitting stop. Okay. Right now, Tammy has it at $13. Seconds left guys. Seconds left now. And stop. And I'm just going to refresh once more and Tammy at $13. Congrats, Tammy. Good job, ladies. Oh, Awesome, Tammy. So cool. Okay, let's do the giveaway. And then I think we're just going to call it a night. What do you say? What do you say? So the giveaway is it's going to be a doily set, okay? So I'm gonna write down a number. We're gonna pick, um, one through 50. Everybody pick one number. Closest to without going over. And there's the number right here. <coughs> Closest to without going over will win the doilies. I'm going to put these in this lovely little packaging here. Let's see. Let's 
So everybody get your number in. So it's going to be closest to this number without going over will win. Everybody got their number. You want to get in on it, get your number in. Okay. So, are you ready to see who won? And I can tell you right now, let's see. I do see someone. Okay, so it's closest to without going over. Oh, okay, Lois is in. Okay, Lois will take that. Anyone else before I flip the number? Let me move. Okay. Get your number in, everybody. Anybody else? I took away the stop, so. Okay, I'm hitting stop for real this time. Okay, so the number was 40. So closest to without going over would be Lois. Congratulations, Lois. You are the winner. <coughs> congrats, congrats. <coughs> Excuse me. Lois. I'm so happy for you, Lois. That's awesome. Congratulations. So you get the doily set. Okay. So thank you, ladies, for hanging out with me tonight. I didn't want to go too long while we already had internet issues tonight. Um, but I think it went really well. Other than that, we had that one little hiccup. Um, so that's good. Just, just that once. Um, but, yeah, everything seemed to go fairly smoothly. Um, I was a little worried because of last week, um, where it just was deleting everything. Yes, Lois, congrats, where it was just deleting all the comments. So I was a little concerned about that tonight, but it went really well. So thank you all so much. Um, so let's just really quickly, thank you, Susie. So, um, speaking of Susie, make sure everybody makes it to the Defy auction tomorrow. And the auction is going to be a little bit different this month. If you didn't hear earlier, it's going to be. Um, no shipping. So whatever you purchase, you'll be purchasing like classes, um, things like that. Okay. So, and Susie has offered um, a sign language class, which is phenomenal. So if you can do that, that would be wonderful. Um, so make sure you head to CARES channel tomorrow, as well as Pearl on Sunday. Pearl will be having a sale with Luz on Sunday. Um, is there anything else happening this weekend that I need to announce for everybody? Oh, you're welcome, Susie. Uh, thank you, Angie. You're welcome. Thank you so much, Donna. Thanks, Kay. It was wonderful having you. I'm on every Friday night at 6 o'clock. Usually I try to do 6 to 10, but I wanted to kind of give it a little test tonight and see what would happen since we had such a tough week last week. Um, any other announcements or anything else going on in anyone's channel that they want to announce as well? Please feel free to do it now. Absolutely. Let us know what's going on. Let us know what's going on this weekend if we need to be anywhere. Tammy says her next sale is Tuesday. This Tuesday coming, Tammy, at 5 p.m. Eastern. Awesome, Tammy. Oh, well, that's good. Sometimes you just need to be there for those people, Pearl. Wonderful that you are. Good. That's wonderful. Is that this Tuesday, Tammy? I think, I think it's this Tuesday. Anything else going on, ladies? All righty then. I'm going to say good night. Thank you all so much for coming. I will be invoicing after tonight. So keep an eye out for those invoices. Um, ah, 
can know now. I don't have any left, Pearl. I have none left to sell. I mean, I have my own stash, my personal stash, but I have none left to sell at the moment. We went through them all. <laughs> Perfect, Tammy. Thank you. Um, oh, thanks, Lois. I appreciate that. Thank you all so much. I will be invoicing, like I said, after tonight. There'll be the dollar fifty service fee like normal. Um, I'm trying to think what else. Anyone that was new, make sure you send me the information. My my email is in the drop down in case anyone does need it. And good night, everyone. Thank you all so much. Oh, actually, Liz. Liz, you guys are doing another sale, you and May and Karen. Correct? And that's coming up soon, I want to say, right? Or not, maybe not too soon. I know that Liz is doing another collaboration with Karen and May. And they'll be selling, I believe, on May's channel again. I, I, okay, on the 17th. Perfect. My son's birthday. I don't know if you'll make it. I hope so. Is it during the day? <laughs> she says, stay in touch, my fellow Brooklyn girl. Oh my goodness. So yeah, guys, make sure you try to make it over to May's channel on the 17th. Two to eight. Okay. Oh my gosh. I think that's um that's the day we're doing the birthday party for my kids because my my two little kids are two days apart. So we're having one party for them together on the that day. So I don't make it. Oh Lord. All right. Good night, ladies. I'll stay in touch with you this week, I'm sure, throughout the lives. I'll talk to you soon. Big hugs. See you soon, ladies. Bye-bye.